Hi, this is Roger Eastlick, and in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you three cool features, new features of WordPress 3.4. So, what we're going to do first is going to log into the site and put a type in the domain name, then a forward slash, then WP ADMIN, ADMIN. Enter, put our credentials in there, and enter again. We're going to get that gets us into the dashboard. Now, we're going to go over here to appearance. And then I'm going to go over here to themes. And you're going to see over here, if you scroll down, for example, down over here to the 2010 or to a theme that's not installed, you'll see something here called Live Preview. If you click on Live Preview, it brings up that theme over in the right hand side of your screen. Um, so you can see what it looks like, and that's only happening on for you. It's not going to that not going to happen for anybody else. Nobody else is going to see that. Um, over here to the left, the other thing you can do is you can actually do theme customizations. Again, you can do that without anybody seeing, so you can just see sort of what it's like. You can change the site title and the tagline if you want to. Um, you can you have a chance of changing the colors. For example, if you wanted to um, change the background color, for example, you could go ahead and do that by picking a color, and it will actually show you here. Um, it will actually show you the background here. It's a little bit tight on my screen since it's not; it's kind of reduced down but you kind of get the idea you can you can do that you can also um, if you wanted to you could change the header image by adding one of the uh, images that they already have there or you can drag and and drop your, your own image file in there um, they've got some default ones you could use and select or you can just go ahead and remove it um, you can do the same thing with a background image, um, and then you can choose whether or not you have a static um, front page or your latest posts. So those are two, two cool new features. The other feature that I think is really cool has to do with um, the ability to put live Twitter um, or put the Twitter URLs in a post and have it actually show you um, the, actually the Twitter feed rather than rather than just the URL. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a new post. We're going to go to post and then add new. And up here at the title top we're going to say uh, embed a tweet because that's actually what we're doing. We're embedding the tweet in there. We're going to go grab a URL of a Twitter conversation. And you can actually do that by going into Twitter your Twitter account and and if you hover over expand you can uh, copy the link address and then you go back to your post and if you're in HTML mode you go ahead and, and uh, paste right click and paste that in there and under visual it should be so it's not hyperlinked as you can see and then all we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and publish that and take a look at it and if we go down here you can see that there is the actual tweet right like that so um, those were three cool new feature features the live preview the theme customizations and embedding a tweet in WordPress 4.0 thanks for watching have a great day